need to get to cleaning my closet. This is... I cannot believe we made it this far with Vlogmas. Why does my hair look like that? Today was a long day and I literally just need to freshen up and get some rest. So that's kind of like the night routine I'm going for tonight. Really just doing some planning, doing my skincare, just taking care of myself. So, oh my god, I can't speak. Just taking care of myself and spending time alone. I am just going to be taking you guys along through my night routine that I do every single night. As a YouTuber, as a senior year in high school student working online. Today is a Saturday and I feel like I got a lot done. I'm just like really exhausted and I really want to take off my makeup want to shower so that's like the first thing i'm gonna do i'm gonna take a shower and i'm gonna do my skincare I definitely need to clean my closet so that's something that I need to do like after my shower or whatever I do I need to get to clean my closet this is not it I feel like this is the only place though that's like a mess because I did clean my room recently so it's not looking like crazy obsessed with like piano music i don't know what it is but just like piano music like it's simply just it like it literally is just so calming and this is literally the only thing i've been listening to whenever i go to a park or anything like i'm walking outside i'll literally romanticize it and i'll just listen to like some piano music i may sound insane for this but like it's just so calming and peaceful i love it i'll also have my spotify on the screen so you guys can go check out my spotify i haven't really been posting on there i haven't been that active but i will try to be more active I actually made like the mix in the morning and then I did try it and it was like okay Like I feel like I didn't cook it that well So i'm gonna be trying to redo it again and then see if I can do it better and i'm actually really hungry I usually eat like a snack, but I am starving and it's not really like a snack snack It's more of like a I don't know what you call it, but i'm hungry This is the best that we got to. The back is like literally burnt. It's embarrassing. Oh, all that hot. But we're gonna try it and see if it's good. so good at first i didn't like it because it just tasted so different than like an actual matcha i got from like the coffee shop but this is actually really good for like homemade because every other matcha that i buy is literally like the powder is just too much i don't know if it's because like i don't know how to make it it's probably that but i really don't like it so this is like the only easiest matcha and like best tasting matcha that i'm gonna get to so for skincare i usually try not to put too much on my face i'm trying to not put too much on my face but i end up doing i use these clips to get get my hair out of my face because since i'm gonna be putting all this like moisturizer and like serums on my face i just need my hair out of my face i washed my hair this morning and it feels so soft like it's so nice i feel like these clips just make me look insane i have no clue first thing i do is i put the glossier moisturizer with the bloom hydrating oil or sometimes i'll go in with like this first which is the super pore pure by glossier and it's so nice like it makes my skin feel very refreshed but we're gonna go in with the hydrating oil today it's basically just like a little serum that you put in with the moisturizer and it's just makes my face feel like very soft and like so shiny it's so nice but in a clean way i need to take off my contacts first we're gonna do that Once 
I got that on my face, I go in with the, what do I go in with? Washa, so I kind of just try to get that jawline look. I do this every night because, I don't know, it just works with me. I've been doing it for so long and I swear, I kid you not, like I think this is what helps me with all these like little facial tools, which I use this and I use this. It's just so nice. Like I have seen such a big difference. So I always make sure to put this into my daily routine, either like if it's in the morning or night, whatever time it is. This, you guys, is literally the best. This is the Aquaphor Lip Repair. If you have, like, really dry lips, then this will literally repair it so quickly. Like, it's so nice. And I literally just wake up with, like, soft skin. As well as this. I haven't been using it recently, but I know this, like, works wonders because I've used it before. And I was, like, obsessed with it. So I definitely recommend it. It's the Laneage Lip Sleeping Mask. And it's, like, in the berry flavor. I don't even know. But it literally smells like berry. Like, it's just insane. Today, I'm just going to go in with the Aquaphor Lip Repair. Also, if you have lash extensions, make sure you're like brushing them every night because this goes for me as well. I struggle with like cleaning them and like brushing it. There's like a phase where I just want to clean it and like clean it at all times, like every night, every morning. Sometimes I just like lack on it so much. So make sure you're in your eyelashes if you have eyelash extensions. If not, you're fine. <laughs> just write in my journal i'm so sorry i have my retainer and so it's like so hard to say my s's like i sound like i have a list but yeah i'm just gonna write in my journal this is kind of like my diary like that's what i call it because i have like my first ever journal which i started in like fifth grade and i'm still writing and i write like how my day went my affirmations whatever i'm trying to manifest so i just write it down all in this and then i also like to listen to frequency which is called heal your feminine energy which is kind of like a self-love type of frequency to work on like self-worth confidence whatever it is so i listen to this while i write in my journal and then i'm going to meditate breathe with me slow breath inhale and uh, on the exhale, it all and feeling more and more relaxed. I just finished meditating and writing my journal and I feel so good. My skin feels so soft. I just feel so good. Whenever I do like all of this stuff, I just feel good. And I have been doing this for so long. Like I'm being real with you guys. I'm definitely not faking it. This is what I do every night. Except for the meditating, I have been doing that for three days in a row. And this is like my, I think this is actually my fourth day. I can't tell. I don't remember. But I'm actually so proud of myself. Like I definitely recommend meditating. I've been feeling so much better and so much calmer. I don't know how to explain it. Like I just feel so much more at peace with myself whenever i meditate and throughout the day like i just get things way done quicker i also tend to fall asleep way faster whenever i meditate so i haven't been having that much like toughness with like sleeping and i'm so grateful for that something that helps me a lot too is journaling and it feels so much better too after journaling because i'm just like letting out whatever that's in my mind onto my journal without like any feedback from anybody it's just like me writing down my thoughts without judgment knowing that nobody's gonna read it just like all at peace it just makes me so much more connected with myself i don't know how to explain it i just feel so much more at peace I, that's like the only word i can explain it as it's like therapy and whenever i write in my journal i focus on being grateful because whenever i'm grateful i just feel like things flow more easily whenever i talk about like the negatives in my life which i do sometimes like i try to let everything out because like that's the whole point of like a journal is just letting things out but sometimes i just like writing down things and being grateful for it and just focusing all on gratitude 
gratitude because whenever you're grateful you receive more no matter what it is like when you're grateful for like such little things like being able to sleep on a bed or having a phone or whatever it is like having food obviously like the littlest things being grateful for those things it's just like so nice because you overall feel better about yourself and you overall receive more but this is everything I do in a night just to start off the day right the next day because I think your night routine is like so important if you're just like falling asleep and just doing nothing I feel like your day could go a little bit rough I usually tend to like plan the night before but something that I realized is to stop planning the night before because I get too carried away with like planning my stuff and then when I wake up I'm just like so dead because I didn't get enough sleep because I was planning so something I'm trying to work on is like not planning at night like tonight I planned like literally this much like I think I planned for like four minutes and that was it because I do get a little too carried away with that anyways I'm gonna go to sleep